Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Tech. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when your Chromecast remote is not working properly and how you can repair it to the TV. Now, go ahead and flip it over and take out the battery, just like this. Then hold down the power button right here for at least 15 to 20 seconds and make sure all the power dissipates out of the remote. So after holding this down for about 15 seconds, press every button down on the remote going from the top to the bottom and make sure there's no button accidentally pressed in and do this numerous times. Then go ahead and put your batteries back in and hold down the power button. So let's go ahead and put these back in. Now you can see the light is blinking right here. Let's hold down the power button. See if we can turn on our TV. Now if your TV is not turning on when you press the power button, we do need to set up a new TV on our Chromecast. Now go to your Chromecast and press down this button and just hold it down for like two seconds. You'll see the light will be like orange for a second. Then go back to the TV and it will say searching for accessories. Now repair your remote back to the TV. It says before pairing your Bluetooth devices, make sure they're in pairing mode. To start pairing a remote, hold down the back button and the home button until you see the lights pulsing on the remote. So let's hold both these buttons down and then the light should begin to pulse on the bottom. All right, so it just blinked once. I'm assuming it's reconnecting. So I'm gonna press the home button and here is the home screen. Now to set up a TV, go on over to your picture icon right here, go on down to settings. Now under here, let's go on down to the bottom until we get to remote and accessories, go to the right. Then go to set up remote buttons. Then go to where it says add device. Let's add a TV right here and select this and find the brand of your TV. The most popular ones are on the top here. I'm using an Amazon Fire TV, so I'm going to go to Amazon right here, select this, then set up your volume controls for it, the power and the input. So I know my power button wasn't working, so I'm going to go to that, press the power button once. Did the power button work? Yes, my TV turned off. So I'm going to select that and my input button worked too. I was able to switch my inputs. I can see it over here and my volume button works right here. So my TV is set up now. So if this video did indeed help you out, leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech up videos coming up next on your six tech.